you have uh, COVID, it's really important that you get as much breath into your lungs as possible. The bulk of your lungs are in your back. So you have to actually turn onto your tummy and it's called proning. So that's one. Two, there's a way you breathe that allows your lungs to absorb as much oxygen as they need. So let me actually show you how to prone, which is turn onto your tummy so that you open your lungs to let in air as much, you know, sort of air and literally allow the muscles of your lungs to expand as much as possible without any or very little effort. Uh, because often you're, when you have COVID, you're really tired. So what you do is you take one foot over the other and actually begin to turn your head and let your head and your foot pull you over onto your tummy. Now, you have the option. You can put your hands under your chin. You can put your hands under your chest. If you're going to stay in this position for a long time, you can actually put tuck a pillow under your tummy and a pillow under your forehead. So you're lifted up and you don't hurt your back. Now you can also, if you have the slightest bit of energy, put your arms out and then pull them back until they lie under your shoulders and that will open your lungs a little bit more. Now how do you breathe? The important thing is to stop between your in-breath and your out-breath out and between your out-breath and your in-breath and your out-breath when you're breathing out that breathing out has to be longer than when you breathe in and it doesn't matter how long or short anything else so let me show you i'm going to go back and put my head on my forehead on my arms i don't know if you can see but basically you breathe in when you breathe in you let the ba your back really fill up with air. Let your tummy fill up with air. So breathe in. Hold for two counts. And then breathe out. I'm going to breathe out for five counts. Hold for two counts. I'm going to breathe in for three counts. Hold for two counts. Breathe out for five counts. Hold. Now let me show you how to turn back onto your back with very little effort. Take one arm out and begin to move your head and let your feet flop and you will just find you flop onto your back very easily. All right.